Hi guys, it is a spectacularly gorgeous morning here in the end times in paradise in the lovely little town of Twin Lakes, California on this gorgeous Monday morning, July 10th, 2017 and I'm packing up my gas sucking truck and heading to Babylon for one night. But before I go, I do want to share today's comment of the day. And we're going to hark back to, I think, the fellow who got the very first comment of the day a couple of months ago. Technetizen. Technetizen commenting on Paul Watson's doomsday sermon yesterday that uh, human lives are not more important than animal lives. Take it away, Technetizen. <clears throat> People are what their culture and economic system encourage them to be. The religious psychobabble of free will is just that. And then this is one sentence coming up. <clears throat> Talking about religious psychobabble. Irrelevant and ineffective babble in the face of a culture and economic system where people sell themselves out as prostitutes for the people who have the money to pay them so they could have the income to live or are the privileged class of merchant owners themselves who need to constantly sell their wares and services that are produced by the mass labor of the clueless moron masses back to the clueless moron on masses so they could preserve their social position as members of the privileged few rich merchants among the endless sea of poor and ignorant peasants which comprise the majority of people in what we now call civilization. There is not one comma in that sentence. It is pointless to complain or debate because the examples of idiots that Paul Watson has encountered in his conversations with his students in his class who are most likely just typical products of this culture and social system will be the people who will keep the momentum of this system which demands continual consumption and infinite growth going until we hit ecological lap collapse. It's an out of control runaway train that nobody is able to stop. As Guy McPherson says, relax because nobody is in control and we are all going to die. Thank you my very much Technetizen for getting me on the road to Babylon and uh, I'm going to picking up my canoe tomorrow and heading out into the lake so I don't know when you guys are going to hear what's it's going to be like around here for the rest of this week I will be back when I'm back bye guys